I cannot. I see that like in December. If, if you see one of my interviews, I was gonna like ready for this moment. That was unbelievable. So crazy there. And I, I didn't know like the race gonna be so fast. You know, like 7:48 in like 5,000. I, I think attitude. That's too hard. That was too fast for me. I was just like, if you see my last three laps, I was just gonna like drop. But like, I know I can't lose hard. And my friends like told me I could be like 26. That was that was that was amazing. That was my one of my best races in my life. When you look at the way the race played out, the purpose was, of that race was basically to make it to neutralize you in a way because no, they're more strike based uh, like, and you have that speed, but it didn't no, work. No, if you know like my my PB is like 741, so I can handle this pace. I already like told that in like December earlier this season when I ran 744. Then. I went back and ran 741, so I'm kind of like ready, even the race is going to be fast or like set and kick. I was like kind of prepared for this moment now. I've been waiting for this moment for a long time. Finally, I can call myself national champion now. I'm so proud to be here and I'm so blessed like to be healthy and to be one of these great athletes here in Prince of A. Uh, I don't know how to describe this man. I'm so happy. This is your first season in the NCAA. No, right? I've been here last year. Oh, last but, year. Yeah, I ran like season 50. I didn't make a national. I ran DMR. We got fifth. I was like the lead, the, the 1200 legs. Yeah, I was kind of like, because I got here in like January. But like, you know, like school and this life, I, I couldn't like balance my life. Yeah. So it was really hard for me. I don't. I don't know how to do I did 339, but I was like 7 up to 612, and I didn't make it to the national. This year, like, outdoor is right in the corner, I'm trying to, to continue what I do today in the outdoor show. What event did you think you were, like, so were you were 1500 I'm a 1500, yeah. yeah. But I scratched the mile, because, like, I did so many, like, volume this season, like, through the, the cross country season. I got 12 in the course, so it kind of make me like build my volume. So this is why I prefer the three kid and uh, then the mile this year. But I think probably we're gonna see what happened in Algo. I don't know, maybe 15 or 5k, whatever. I just wanna win. Yeah. How'd you end up at Oklahoma State? Uh, Coach Dave and Coach Justin Duncan recruited me and they explained to me what is NCA because I didn't know what it, what's going on here. Like. There is like some student athlete run in the university, which is, we don't have this in that home. We have only like clothes. So when he told me what's going on here, I like that. And I also want to like continue my studies. This is why I choose Oklahoma State. Yeah. And what was the toughest part of the transition from Morocco to the US? Uh, I, I think like the training. Yeah, training kind of different. Because uh, we used to do like a lot of intensity workouts in that home. Here, like the program mainly focus on like like threshold stuff, and I kind of like the I kind of like the program and the team. Yeah, I feel like I'm comfortable here. I like the I like the situation here. Yeah, yeah. But it seems like it's, this weekend couldn't have gone much better between the DM. Uh, and the that was the best end. Like, can anyone hope? Uh, ending up with two double champion. Yesterday, DMR was fantastic, and today we just complete what we did yesterday. Uh, I'm so proud of myself today. Uh, I'm so happy for being here. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you.